Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa, I'm a cruelty YouTuber that is trying to have a yellow no by, which I'm almost done with. And today I am using one of my favorite palettes and it is another part in my 13 days of red and we are on an S. And if you have ever heard me talk about palettes, I think you can guess which palette it is if I say if it is that it is one of my favorites. It's of course side by side by Nabla. I do love this palette. This is my absolute favorite neutral palette. I just think it's so so nice. And today I'm actually thinking about doing something that I usually don't do with this palette. Often when I'm using this I think my three most used shades is this, this and this. But today I'm thinking about going into the grey and like this grey um, shimmers well just to like test things that I usually don't do with this palette. And I actually think that I've used all the shades in this palette. Um, but yeah, I'm guess I'm just going to prime my eyes and then we get started. So I think I will go in with Cubism. I can't remember how deep this is. <laughs> but I'm going to go in with Cubis... Cubism? Coal Clam <laughs> and um, Titled and then Lover Ritual. And if you didn't know this about me, <laughs> I do not love uh, grey eyeshadows that much. But I'm really trying on my shirt. I'm really trying to use things that isn't a favorite for me and just test it and see like can I use maybe the shade in a different way or a different undertone or something just to see if I can make it my bitch. I think it's going kind of good. So okay this wasn't too dark and I can build it up a little bit which I do like and I was thinking about like what should I talk about today but I don't know I have actually no idea what I want to talk about and it just feels like this is getting more more boring as long as this series do go on if I'm going to be honest but I'm trying my best over here to have something to talk about and try to be somewhat fun to watch and soon it's time for my last update in my no buy it's coming in in a couple of days and then I'm also doing a video where I am going to give some tips and like things to think about if you are going to do a no buy or a low buy. And it feels like now a year in, I'm getting a hang of this actually. So it's going to feel a little bit strange to not do it anymore. And I'm like pretty certain that I don't want to do this next year. Because I know there is some things that I want to buy. And now the cats, I think they're going crazy again. It's like they know that when I'm filming, it's fun to make sounds. I don't know if you can see them back there. I think we are off to a kind of a good start. I think I do think this is kind of fine. So I'm going to win with this clan and I'm not sure if I'm going to take the black one. Maybe but I'm going in with this clam. Clan. It's clan, not clam. Clan. I like no even though this is one of my favorite palettes, I've noticed like I don't know what the colors are called because I just use them. So I'm going to take this out here 
and I don't think I actually mind this and I'm going to try to take it a little bit in my crease as well and have you been shopping for Christmas gifts or do you even celebrate Christmas in Sweden we celebrate on the 24th so on Christmas Eve and I have bought one Christmas present so far today it's the 15 is it the 15 when I'm filming this yes and I have bought one Christmas present I think though that I know two more that I'm going to get but like I'm not uh, buying that many presents um, so yeah but like I don't the thing I've started to enjoy more now when I'm older when it comes to Christmas is just spending time with family if you didn't know this I live pretty far from my parents and uh, Christmas 2020 we were supposed to go to my mom then I got really sick in the panini can you say the name and not being like flagged for uh, giving information not flagged but like oh you are talking about this we want to tell everybody um so we didn't celebrate christmas and new year's i was having a high fever and the year after we were like maybe it's not a good thing to go so we did celebrate with my boyfriend's uh, siblings and uh, yeah, then we bought some presents but usually yeah usually I, I don't think that is that special and i think it is because i am older i don't think it's not like the same I remember when I was little and I like wrote such big wish lists. I'm going to use my glitter primer. Um, and <laughs> like half of it was CDs. Like, um, is it CDs? Yeah. Because I did love the music and when I was younger, like, if you wanted to listen to something, either you had to listen to the radio, watch MTV, or by the record so like half of my list was cds and the other half was like i can't even remember maybe everything was records that i wanted i don't know but now i think it's so hard like now i wish for things that i could buy myself but if i come up with something that i want like in november I'm like, okay, I'm going to not buy this and wish for it for Christmas instead. So the only things that I wish for this Christmas, I wish for, there is a Swedish food magazine, a vegan one that I wished for and some bed sheets in linen, washed linen because those are expensive that is like the only things that i wished for and if i get them i get them if i don't i don't then i guess i'm going to buy them myself okay i'm going in with love ritual this one so is there anything special that you wish for for christmas or are you like me that you just want to hang out with family or friends or do you not even celebrate Christmas and just having it as whatever day at a year and I do really like this love ritual it's a little bit like shifting and I like it and I do like this gray shades as well Okay, I do really like this look, so maybe grey is my thing. So I am going to take away the fallouts and we're going to pick out a lip together. And I think... I have two Nablas left. 
So I guess it's going to be one of them. But yeah, I will fix my face and then I come back and we put on the lip together. So it's time for the lips and I have these two from Nabla that is Rumors and Rogue Assassin. And I think that Rumors is a little bit more cold tone. It at least looks like it's a little bit dark. Maybe it's just darker. I think it's so hard like when it's frosted. But either this one or this one. I think I will go in with this. This is Rumors. This is one of my favorite reds from Nabla and one of my favorite reds. I think I have a cat hair in my mouth. Mouse. Okay, I think that this lip goes really good for my... It is really like a Nabla face. I did use Ombra, Independence and Ozone on my face. On my watch line I did take Honey Dude from Colourpop and yeah, I took Rumors from Nabla. And I do really like this look and even though it is grey, I still really like it. So for my face, no, my eyes, I did use Clan. Love Ritual and Cubism. Cubism? Cubism, maybe. And yeah, this is one of my favorite palettes. And I just think it's a really good mix for being a neutral palette. It is both cold, a little bit warm, and I like that it is um, the, the ratio on shimmers and mattes. And I do hope that you like this video and it's always fun to do a look with my side-by-side -side palette because I do like it so much. So I really hope you have liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope that I will see you in the next one. Bye!